Ooh, kill him. Ooh, kill him. Ooh. Okay, that's enough. What's up, y'all? This your girl, Go Mouth. And y'all already see where I'm at. Y'all see where I'm at. Ooh, kill him. Hey. Ow. Mm, she got the bunny. I'm in the kitchen. This is something that happens on a rare occasion for me now. But anyway. I'm getting ready to cook something I call potato soup. Um, but guess what, y'all? Before I even get started telling y'all how I made this, it was real simple. It was like three steps, maybe four. But I thought I had invented it until I looked it up on YouTube after I had already cooked it. So in my head, I invented it, okay? So this is potato soup. I think that's what you call it, or potato boiled potatoes, whatever. Anyways, if you're interested, stay tuned. Okay, y'all, so before I started recording, I had already started cooking because I wasn't going to do a video, but a lot of you guys have been requesting me to do a cooking video, and since I am in the kitchen, this video is for you. Whoever been waiting on me to do a cooking video, here you go. Share it with all your friends and your mom and them, okay? So all I did is I got some red potatoes, a big old bag of red potatoes. Red potatoes. Not the other potatoes, but I guess you can do them with the other potatoes, but these potatoes taste better. And I, I got these potatoes, and I cut them with the help of my little boy. Cut them up, okay? And they have been boiling now for about, um, I'm going to say they've been boiling for about 30 minutes. So they are at the consistency that I want them to be. Um... I cooked this um, a couple weeks ago. I was just trying something, tr to try something. Um, well, actually, no, I kinda wasn't, but what had happened was it was Scooby's birthday and he wanted a crab boil, and um, I can't afford that, so I said I'll do him a shrimp boil, and then the shrimp boil ended up into like a soupy thing, and then what happened after that was we had to call it potato soup, <laughs> whatever. <laughs> Hence the name. That's because it looks like soup more. And um, I bought these eggs. Well, Scooby bought these eggs. And uh, I'm just going to put these eggs in there since they already um, peeled. They already peeled. So I'm just going to drop them down in there because the potatoes are done. And um, just so the, um, the eggs will take on the flavor of the potato mixture. And it's not a potato mixture. It's just straight up potatoes. So what's, what I season this with is garlic powder, garlic powder, onion powder, um, season all, and I put a little bit of uh, complete seasoning in it. And that's it. So I'm going to smother those eggs with this mixture. I don't know why I want to call it a mixture, but it's just potatoes. And I'm just going to let them sit there. You know, and that's it. So now, we go on to the next part, which is the shrimp. Okay, y'all, so I got my shrimp. This is the kind of shrimp that I have. Extra large shrimp from Walmart. I got shrimp from Walmart. I got potatoes from Walmart. It's a Walmart thing. I got two bags. Two bags of extra large shrimp. And I'm just going to cook these separate from the potatoes. Let them heat up. And I'll be back. No, I'm not going to peel the skins off or tails off. I'm not going to do all that. They already deveined and peeled, but they still have the tail on. I'm going to leave the tail on because whoever eating them can peel their own tail off. Okay, y'all. So I got my shrimp cooking. And what I season that with is season all black pepper, the cheap kind, some onion powder, and some garlic powder. Powder. Not garlic salt, garlic powder. It's a difference. I'm trying to find it for you. Here we go. <laughs> garlic powder and some onion salt. That's it. You can season it with whatever you want. You can put you some Old Bay in there and all of that. But I ain't got no Old Bay, so that's what I use, okay? And just get that in there. And you put you like a tablespoon of butter. There is your tablespoon of butter. That's all you need. Let this start cooking. Y'all stir it up. Let's 
with that buttermilk and let them cook. Okay, y'all. So, I, what I forgot to tell y'all is add a can of cream of chicken soup. This is a big giant can from Walmart. It's the Walmart brand, but I'm going to add half of this because last, the last time I added one small can of cream of chicken soup. So I'm just going to do half and then stir the potatoes up in there. What I did do, y'all, is I cooked the potatoes a little bit too long this time um, because I don't you don't want them to be mushy. Not all of them anyway. You want them to be still a whole potato, mostly. You want most of them to be whole potatoes. Now, some of them are going to break up, but some of them aren't. You want big chunks of potato. I mean, unless you want them to break up, but I didn't, last time they didn't break up as much, but hey, I'm going to go on with the video anyway. Y'all learn from my mistakes, okay? <laughs> and then once you get through with that, you just put the shrimp in there, let it sit, marinate, and then you're done. So the shrimp are ready. They are done. I let them cook until they get, you know, a little color to them and they, sh they shrink up a little bit. So they are not as jumbo as they seem, you know, as extra large. So they done. So all I'm going to do now is pour them into the potatoes. Okay, so I got the potatoes right there. I'm just going to pour the shrimp in there, just like that. Bam. That's special. Just dumped it in there. Ooh. And just gently, since these mashed, since these potatoes are almost turned into mashed potatoes, just kind of gently fold them over in there. And your potato soup is practically is done. See that? Try to get those bigger potatoes from under there. And when you eat it, you just peel your own tail off your shrimp as you eat it. Got those eggs in there to suck up the flavor um and that's pretty much it i wish i didn't cook the potatoes as long so if you cook this don't cook your potatoes as long because see it starts to turn into mush but that's actually still good so it's still delicious it's just my second time cooking this y'all so don't shoot me but it is good i'm telling you i already tasted it Make sure when you put your shrimp in there, you get you two bags so you'll have enough. And get the large shrimp, the extra large shrimp, so that way you'll at least have the bite of a piece of shrimp in there like that. It won't just be like little small pieces of shrimp. You can add you some sausage in there if you want to or whatever. So I'm going to plate this up and I'll be back. Okay, y'all, here's what it looks like all plated up. See, I got those big jumbo shrimp in there. And you can see the potatoes, and you see the eggs, and that's it, y'all. And I have some, um, some chives, some chives that's chopped up already. And then you can top it with your, you know, with a few chives, like that. And just sprinkle that across each plate, and then you got your potato soup. Ow. <laughs> There you go. Potato shrimp and potato soup, I guess. Or potato and shrimp soup. Okay. And that's it, y'all. And y'all already know what time it is. It's time for somebody to give this a taste. And y'all already know who that somebody is. Y'all ain't seen them in a long time. Okay. Let's let do let's make it do what it do. Let's see what Scooby think. Hey Scooby. Come give it a taste. Come let everybody know what it tastes like. Ooh, 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 how it look? Look good? Yeah, yeah. okay. Kind of, yeah. kind of. Hold on, wait. Which one mine? Okay, okay y'all, we got Scooby here, ready to taste test the potato soup. Mm -hmm. Scooby, tell everybody hey. Hey. Hey y'all. Hey y'all. <laughs> okay, taste it. Let me see. Let everybody know what it tastes like. Okay. Get you some of them chives in there too. That's the green stuff. Oh, that's the shrimp. I can't eat that. You ain't gonna eat the shrimp? Nah. Why not? Because. You don't like shrimp? That's what you I want? Yeah, I know. He 
it tastes good. Good? Is it too salty? No, it's just no, right. Just right. All right. Let me know how the shrimp tastes. Get a shrimp. Get a shrimp. How the shrimp taste? It tastes delicious. Delicious. Mm -hmm. Y'all, Scooby just had a birthday. How old are you now, Scooby? 16. All right. Can you look in the camera at everybody? You looking at them? They looking yeah. at you. <laughs> you know they've been following you ever since you was a little old kid, a lot of people. Okay, that's it? That's all you got to say? You fit to walk away? Yes. Okay, so you give it a thumbs up? Yep. Yep, all right. All right, now that's all we got to say in this video, and we'll... Holla at y'all later. Bye. Bye.